Hey Brawlers, I'm Ventus Knight, back with another weekly Sunday Brawl. Today I'm here with Dirty Dan, a mechanical engineer at Spin Master. Hey guys. And today we are gonna Bakugan Brawl. So let's get started here, flip the Baku core to see who goes first, heads or tails. I'll go heads. Heads it is! You get All to right. place the first Baku core. Great, I'm using shields, tough like you. Hey, <laughs> I'm not gonna object to that. Though, if you're purposely using shields too, then that means... We've, uh, we've got a pretty interesting brawl going on here, pretty uh, aggressive. Normally I try and do something pretty creative, kind of gimmicky, something fun and spicy for you guys, but today I am practicing for the internal Spin Master Bakugan tournament coming up this March. And I am putting together my sort of my deck, the one where I'm like, okay, this is what I know I really want to play, right? So this deck, Triple Faction, as many cards as I can possibly wield in one deck. Dan is actually using two factions with Arliss Fangzor, who is a, a fan favorite around here, around Spin Master, though I don't know if we technically count as fans. He is certainly a favorite. Uh, he's quite powerful. And we're going to have to see who can come out on top. So, placing down the final Baku core there. Let's get started. Drawing five plus one for the start of the first turn. Four, five, plus one. And I'm going to energize this one. Pretty easy choice there. Yes. <laughs> also energize one right here. All right. I am going to hmm, go with this Bakugan. Atrox Ultra. Atrox right. right. Ultra, indeed. Uh, Playing with our character card starting face up for you guys to make it easier for viewing. Ready? Yes. Three, two. Oh, so I go three, two, one brawl. Okay. You ready? Yes. <laughs> Three, two, one, brawl. Oh, shoot, what? <laughs> that right. curve, that was an awful roll. I didn't put enough speed on it. I was too too hesitant. All right, so you're looking at 550 Bs. That was awful. I'm ashamed. I'm rusty. I should have warmed up first. 550, really? Wow. Yeah, with the 250 bonus. Oh, Max Tar Ultra Ventus has, uh, though that's his native faction, so technically mm. you don't say Ventus. He has 300. Okay, interesting. Yes, How much damage are we looking at? Five at the moment. Five? Yeah. That's a lot of damage. One, two, three, four, five. Cool. All right. Let's start the next turn. Hopefully I don't have such an awful roll next turn. I'll draw. I will... Energize. I will also energize. Again. And I'm ready to brawl, dude. All right. As am I. Three, two, one, brawl. What? <laughs> don't, don't! Oh! <laughs> if Havocor opened, I was going to rage. Because <laughs> that happened to me while battling Grotesque last week. And oh, man. Oh, man. I was steaming for days. Three, two, one, brawl. Yes! <laughs> it's a big brawl, boys. Let's go. Trox Ultra picking up my plus 300, plus 3 damage rating Baku Core. Mm. But you got the plus 300 Baku plus Core, 300 too. So here. we're 300 versus 300. It all comes down to the cards that we play. I'm going to play Super Shop for one energy. Plus 300 B power. And I will not respond. Really? Yeah. Oh. Spicy decision. All right. Well, since Trox Ultra is the victor of this uh, little brawl here going on, then I actually get to energize a card from my hand uncharged. So I'm going to energize. I'm not going to tell you, but I'm energizing a card <laughs> from my hand, that's for sure. Okay. We are dealing today. One plus three is four damage. You got to fold that Halcor Ultra back up. We are one open Bakugan to one open Bakugan, on par for the team attack progress here. All right, what are we looking at? You say four? Yep. Uh, oh, Umbral Slash. Do that. Two, three, and, oh, actually, yes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> did, you, did you see the card that you no, started? No, I did not, Okay, Sorry. all right, all right. I was thinking that. Technically, uh, you started the flip. You bypassed yeah. the flip card, but you know what? This is a casual match. Casual. It's casual. Yeah. We try to play pretty play, play competitively, but in the event of something like that, I'm a nice person. I know I'm going to win, so I'll, just, I'll give you this one. I'll make you feel on top for now. I'll let it right. slide. Yeah, You'll so repel my Ventus repel damage. Ventus. Yeah. Let's drop. 
he knows I like Ventus, so he put in a lot of stop Ventus. <laughs> yeah. Before we start the match, he's like, hey, uh, Ventus Knight, could I, uh, could I ask you what factions are playing in your deck? I'm like, no. <laughs> Come on. Get so, on that one. Uh, let's see here. We are gonna... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Energize one of these. Hmm. Yeah, let's do that. It's probably, probably a good choice. I don't know. <laughs> no. uh, oh, I gotta re-energize. So now we're looking at four energy here. Which one is this? Yeah, sure. Let's go with that. Let's see. He's got Arliss Fangzor, and he's got uh, Darkest, uh, or just Halakor Ultra, because that's yes. his native faction. That's true. Hmm. Let's go with. Uh, hmm. Even if Pegatrix picks up a Shield Baku Core. Her plus 100 buff won't be enough to trump the 700 B power of Fangzor. So, I'm thinking... I'm, I'm thinking still Pegatrix, actually. Let's go. All right, yeah. I'll go with the Fangzor. Three, two, one, bra. Yes! Ooh. Pegatrix activates and blocks Arliss Fangzor's path. Don't have to worry about that B power. And we're getting plus two damage rating. Unfortunately, that was one of two non-shield Baku cores on the field. So yeah. we are only looking at four damage rating right now. But, but, uh, nah, no buts. All right, and so uh, Aquas? Yeah. So I'll block this. Nope. Oh. Two... Four, you said? Yes, four. four. Now, I would like to say, when you discard a flip card, or when you flip a flip card, you get to choose whether or not you want to play it. Right. So even if you can play it, you don't have to. You flip the card, seize Serenity. Oh, wait, that's Chaos. Never mind. Right. <laughs> Never yeah. mind. I was going to I was gonna sass on you, yeah. but... Uh, oh, whoop, no, no. Whoop. I certainly <laughs> missed opportunity. <laughs> All right. Let's head <laughs> into the next turn here. Draw our card. Oh! Oh, I'm liking this uh, card. Doesn't feel good. Uh, mm hmm. I'll energize this one. Energize this one We're looking here. at five energy here. I'm going to roll five energy? Chaos Serpentine's Ultra. Yeah, because of my uh, Trox Ultra's victory. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's why I have Turbo right now. Okay. No, no, I'm not playing any Turbo right. cards. <laughs> 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 not saying that, but. <laughs> Three, two, one, Brawl. Well, <laughs> both of us, awful rolls. <laughs> that was such a weird angle for my Serpentine's Ultra. You got to brawl with conviction. Yeah. If you just kind of, eh, brawl, then they go off on an angle. I'm nervous today. You can tell. This yeah. is, I feel this is my, my good deck. You know, this is my real yeah. one. I'm bringing my true brawl and power. Three, two, one, brawl. Yes! So you can see Serpentine's Ultra isn't feeling that opening-y today. He's a little sleepy, but he clearly stuck to the Baku core and picked mm -hmm. it up which means that it counts as an activation. Meanwhile, Arliss Fangzor, that only happened that because I touched because him. Because you picked him up. That was because it. I picked him up. Yeah. You can tell the magnet slid onto it because yes. he is feeling like opening up, so that only happened because I picked him up. He was close, it was, but, but not we both now. agree. Yes. So, Therpity's Ultra gaining 250 B power here. Mm, not really going to... Oh, there you go. <laughs> not going to do much because, you know, it's just whatever. I don't need B-Power right now. He gains a Shield Baku Core, and his effect, his little skill here, is plus four damage rating with the Shield Baku Core, so that's five damage rating. Mm -hmm. But this is a team attack. So Chaos Serpentine's Ultra is the one that I rolled, which means that this team attack is going to be Chaos. We're getting a uh, two plus two damage rating from Pegatrix added to Chaos Serpentine's Ultra, so that is four, plus the one plus three from Trox Ultra, so that is four plus four, which is eight, Plus, oh, oh, here we go. Plus four is 12, plus the base one of High Aos Serpentine's Ultra is 13 damage rating, if I am correct. Right, coming from Coming Chaos. at you. Let's go. Uh, one, two. Uh, I will use that. To Stop, not Ventus! Yeah. <laughs> this is actually Ventus Serpentine's Ultra. I misspoke. <laughs> this is a misprinted <laughs> card. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, kind of putting an end to my team attack a little early there, but I'll take it. I'll take it. We're in for the long brawl here. Let's drop. Yeah. Uh, re of course, re-energize. Drop. Mm -hmm. Oh, I gotta return my Baku cores to the field and also uh, close up all my Bakugan. That's right. 
So let's do that real quick before the next brawl. I'm putting this all the way over here. I don't want that. Want nothing to do with that in my shield centric deck. I have five <laughs> shield Baku cores in play in addition to one uh, Helix Baku core. I like the additional Helix from Trox Ultra because Helixes are. Uh, they're cheeky, is probably yeah, the best way to describe them. Put that, yeah. Some of them give serious, crazy debuffs. Some of them give serious, crazy buffs. But some of them give insanely crazy buffs in exchange for maybe, like, plus 600 B power, but minus 3 damage rating. <laughs> so there are some interesting Helix uh, Baku cores out there that I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy experimenting with. They're probably the most fun Baku cores to experiment with in terms of variety. I am... Trying to fold up this Trox Ultra. Make sure to check out our how-to videos. I know that the Trox Ultra one actually has quite a few views already, and I can certainly see why. He's a bit of a tricky one. you got to spin his legs like 300 degrees in order yeah, to fold him up. He's a bit of a contortionist. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, I'm currently standing at... <clears throat> oh, I energized already also. You energized? Yes. You know what? I'm going to uh, take a look at this. Uh, yeah, I'll energize this. So I'm looking at six energy. I want to keep my turbo. Not that I'm playing turbo cards. <laughs> <laughs> that, you know. Uh, let's see. So you got. Let me think here. Mm -hmm. Trox Ultra. Trox Ultra is just a solid Bakugan. I think. I think I want to go with Trox. I'm a boy. All right. I'll let's go with this. my Hellcore. Oh. We're on par with the power. Yep. Three, two, one, brawl. Ah! Are you serious? <laughs> Trox is, uh, he's not really my boy today, huh? <laughs> uh, he didn't pick that up. No, he, uh, no, you think so? Yeah. Oh, yeah, because when you picked him up. So he yeah. counts as opening, but. Uh, right. Yeah, but he didn't, he didn't yeah. quite stick. He didn't quite stick. So All let's right. see what happens here. All right, so I am going to uh, spend five energy. Really? So, yes. What is this? To evolve my Halcor into a Titan Halcor. What is that skill? A thousand B power and one damage rating. This must right. be devastating. And he has plus one damage for each flip card in my deck. Oh, your grand strategy. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you're playing so many flip cards. Yeah. And combine that with Umbral Slash, which, by the way, has Halcor art for it. Yeah. Ooh. So he's using Umbral Slash. It's already baked in. Yeah. yeah. How many are we looking at here? We've got one, two... Three, four, five flip cards. So he's got six damage oh, rating. Base. Unbuffed. But that's all the energy you have. So that let's see. Have. Got a few flip cards and hit this deck. Uh, one, two, mm, three, four, five. Seriously? On the last yeah. damage, I get my Tiger Reflex <laughs> Turbo if you have the most I do, energy. I love it's free. That card. That's a great it's one. such a great card a turbo, if it yeah. stops the damage, yeah. which it didn't. Tiger Reflex is not very good reflexes, right? <laughs> so let's draw into our next turn here. You only need no, one more no, activation in order to team attack. So yes. I gotta send in the best of my best. Uh, uh, I will yeah. energize. I'm at six energy cards. Okay. Okay, I should probably should probably energize this. I know that Arliss Fangzor is the Bakugan that you're gonna choose. Correct. So <laughs> I am going to play Nature's Power for one energy. Ooh. I'm gonna subtract 500 B power from him. He has 200 B power. He sure does. Now for <laughs> two energy, I'm gonna play Think Again. Draw a card, Flow. If you played another card this turn, draw two cards instead. I need to replenish my hand a bit. All right, all right, I'm feeling this. Let's do this, guys. All right. You can win this. Three, two, one, bra. What? <laughs> that was an awful roll, old oh, man. All right, team attack coming at you. Uh, I don't like that. All right, so he picked up uh, plus 300B, but that's all right. Um, but he did pick up a shield. 
So he gets his plus five damage. Okay. On top of his. Two. Oh no, that's so, not okay. No. <laughs> so that's uh, seven from him. Um, this one was six, I believe. And this one is five. Wow. So eighteen. 18. One, two. I think I have one more. Three, four, five, six, oh, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17! Where's my last one? What? I think I energized it. Oh, no. Lost by one damage. I, <laughs> I missed too many rolls this brawl. If I didn't miss my rolls, oh, man, oh, man. That was a very, very good game, Dirty Dan. Great game. <laughs> Great game. Yep. Great uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, subscribe, that's what you gotta do. Leave a like, leave a comment with your favorite deck that you like to use, and uh, Bakugan Brawl!